What is going on guys? It's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and today I bring you Zer's loot for the 13th of January 2017. So it's Friday the 13th today. I've just actually realised that shit. What the living fuck. Um, last night as well we also got the weekly Bungie update for the first, um, well the first time since before Christmas I believe it is. Uh, we'll go through what I believe could be coming after we've seen what Zer has this week oh the damn boy um well, let's get straight into it now if you guys do enjoy the video leaving a like is much much appreciated okay so the hairs this motherfucking week <laughs> okay so we've got a legacy engram costing 31 strange coins this will give you year one special weapon exotics so don't get this shit mixed up for year three shit because you ain't getting jack out of it uh, for the titan we have the empyrean bellicose uh, 13 strange coins offering 62 intellect and 60 discipline aiming while airborne holds you in place with full super orbs recharge and melee um, for the hunter we have the young ahem carver spine offering 52 intellect and 56 discipline 13 strange coins increased trick my grenade duration and gain an additional trick my grenade charge for the wall we have the void bank vestments offering 130 discipline, not bad at all. Spawn with full grenade. Axiom bot gains additional seeker. Also costing 13 strange coins. Then we have the bad motherfucking juju, which is a great weapon. You don't see many people using. Um, I love this bad. You know what? I'm sure it used to have 24 bullets in its magazine. I could be wrong. Yes, I probably am. But yeah, um, it's a great, great weapon. After each kill, this weapon will reload instantly. It's just amazing. You actually, I actually, um, when I actually start using this, it takes me about three or four games to get used to it while using it in PvP. I still get a kill and reload, but then you'll, you'll get slowly used to it. And you can take out a group of enemies with a single clip. It's actually quite good. You can see the three of coins are back, finally. Um, I'm actually stack up on these. I forgot last week. Luckily, they're back. Um, so Bungie haven't cut them from the game. Great. And that's basically about it. We've got glass needles, which went there uh, last week. We've got heavy ammo packs, these bullshit things that no one buys. We've got motes of light, which cost two strange coins. And we've got exotic shards, which cost seven strange coins. And that is Zer's loot. Nothing great, to be honest. Um, Red Vang ain't too bad. Uh, bad Juju is a great weapon. Young Harm Car Spine and Bellicose, same old, same mode. Um, but yes, that is it for Zerza Loot. Now let's get into the weekly update last night. Now, if you missed this somehow, I mean, every Destiny YouTuber has made a video on it already. No doubt your uh, sub boxes were spam last night. I was like playing football in the snow in the beautiful British weather. And when I got home, I was too tired to do a video on it. I mean, literally, I was tired. Running around for two hours in the snow and ice. Slipping on my ass, burning my ass, ain't very good. Um, but yes, they basically stated that um, the Bungie live team are hard at work on another content update which will give us new reasons to fight. Um, I'm guessing this is because it's almost February, February 14th, Crimson Doubles or whatever the fuck that Valentine's event was. Last year I didn't actually play. Um, I don't know why I didn't play it. I mean, I'm, uh, well, people were saying that loot was quite decent. I just didn't play it. When they had no one to play it with, it's just I couldn't be bothered with a PvP event. Um, we get a lot of them already, Iron Banner Trials, um, all sorts of shit. So I wasn't really interested in it. This time though, I will play and cover what I get and whatever it offers, if it is Crimson Doubles. I mean, if it, I think we need something more than Kiss Chase in PvP. I think we need a PV, a, something to do with PvE. I mean, content short at the minute, we all know that. Uh, content's drying up, nothing's changed. Um, and I'm hoping as well, <clears throat> sooner or later, they announce something to do with Destiny 2 because it's they're leaving it a little late. And that's, Speck of information has come out from Bungie. We've had bullshit reports from bullshit people seeking attention on Reddit, uh, dropping bullshit fucking posts about bullshit information that's not true, um, about it being delayed till 2018, so forth, so on, blah, 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 blah. I covered all that in a video as well. If you missed that, you'll find it on my channel. But yes, I'm hoping soon they do drop at least a speck of information on Destiny 2 because we're all waiting. We really are. Now, I've got the uh, Bungie updates on my PC right here in front of me. I mean, apart from the announcement of a new content update coming and a, uh, a patch to fix some of the issues we've been talking about. 
um, shotguns, uh, clever dragon, we'll see. They also I mentioned as well that Iron Banner will be coming back on January 17th, which is next Tuesday. Is it next Tuesday? Let me just double check my date. Um, yes, is it next Tuesday? I'm tired, forgive me. Um, yes, and it will be clashed this time around. Uh, loot on offer will be the sidearms. And I've actually had the sidearm drop. And we also will be having rocket launchers. So sidearm, rocket launchers, not amazing. Um, armors, we will be getting a chest piece. And the gauntlets, which you guys will see on screen now. So Iron Banner will be back on the 17th. They also mentioned as well, the return of... Bungie Bounty Days, which is basically where they play PvP, you play against them and beat them, you get an exclusive emblem. They've changed it up a little now and have put that bounty on bigger dudes in the Destiny community. The first one which is starting today, um, which is 1pm Pacific Time and ends at 3pm Pacific Time, will be Professor Broman, the beastly ass streamer. Now, I'm guessing this will be on PS4. I'm still waiting for them to label somebody on Xbox so we can go into PvP on Xbox and hopefully get this emblem. But I don't think they're going to do that, unfortunately. But uh, yes, so the Bungie Bounty Days will be today, starting at 1pm Pacific and ending at 3pm Pacific. And like I said, it will be Professor Broman, so get into that PvP and try and beat his team. And that's basically it, guys. Um... I will link the full Destiny update within the video description if you guys do want to check it out. Uh, nothing else really of interest in my opinion, but you can still check it out if you want to anyway. But guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think about the live event coming. What do you think it will be? Do you think it will be Crimson Doubles, that Valentine's event? Let me know down below in that comment section. Thanks as always for stopping by, and I'll catch you guys on that next one. Peace out until next time. Peace! Always in the wrong.